My name is Mi Tran. I am from Stockton and I went to the University of the Pacific in Stockton. I received my undergraduate degree there and also my graduate degree. Um, it has a very nice program for educating us regarding the geriatric population in the hospital setting and the nursing home setting and also the home health setting because all of our professors just came from a wide array of environments. Initially, I began working as a speech therapist in the skilled nursing facility and that paved the way for gaining some experience in the home health setting because that is the next transition after someone receives treatment from the nursing facility. So it was very important for me to gain some experience in the home health setting to assure that the transition is safe and also the patient is getting what they need in terms of speech therapy treatment in the home with family members and caregivers. What gets me up in the morning? Uh, basically knowing that every day is different and every day I can change someone's life whether it's um, changing their diet texture so that they can tolerate solid foods rather than a puree texture and uh, that makes me feel very good because it is a quality of life to be able to eat and drink what you desire and also to help people with their communication skills which I think we all do take for granted at times. Focus Health has just been such a great company since I first started. Um, they've given me a lot of um, perspective in regard to home health and how to help patients in different areas and just um, educating other people about what speech therapy is all about. Not only nursing, physical therapy, and occupational therapy, but speech therapy is also in the realm of rehabilitation where people are able to get better in their cognitive skills, swallowing, communication, and voice. I think that we have such a great group of nurses and therapists that are well educated regarding what we do in speech language pathology that they can appropriately refer patients to me so that I can evaluate them for any swallowing or communication disorders. And a lot of them are overlooked so I am just very satisfied that I can come out there and detect a problem and be able to come out and treat that patient and train their family members. These patients, they're in their 60s, 70s, 80s, and they're just so sweet and their families are so supportive. And when I'm able to come in there and help them with the food that they eat and train their family members, and when they say, we've been to three different facilities and we've never had speech therapy before, we didn't even know you existed. And that just really makes me feel good and when um, I'm ready to discharge them because they've met all of their goals, um, sometimes it's just really bittersweet because I'm just glad that they met their goals, but it just gets kind of sad not being able to check on them to make sure they're doing all right. But um, it is really satisfying that I can do that for them.